Okay, now we have this one very interesting question using the concept of all possible selections. Uh, we have to prove that sum of this series is equal to m plus n c r. Okay. Now, look at the terms of the series. Dhyan se dekhe in terms ko. Here we have uh, m c 0 n c r, here we have m c 1 n c r minus 1, then m c 2 n c r minus 2 and here we have m c r n c 0. Okay. What is happening here in this group m c 0, m c 1, m c 2 value here is decreasing okay. and uh, in this group of factors n c r, n c r minus 1, n c r minus 2, n c 0 value is decreasing. Okay. R ke baad R minus 1, fir R minus 2, fir kya ho rahe? 0 ho rahe. And here the sum is constant 0 plus R, 1 plus R minus 1, 2 plus R minus 2, R plus 0, this sum is constant R. Okay. So, what we do? We create one situation, uh, we consider two groups of objects. In first group, we have n different objects and in second group, we have m different objects and uh, none of the object of this group is same as uh, any object of this group. In dono groups ke koi bhi object jo hai, wo aapas mein same nahi hai. Okay. In fact, we have total m plus n number of distinct objects. Now, suppose we have to select r objects from uh, these two groups. Hame, uh, in two groups mein se r objects ko select karna hai. Let us do not merge the groups, in ko hum separate hi rakhte hai. Then, how can we select r objects? We can select all the r objects uh, uh, from this group because value of n is greater than or equal to r. So, sare ke sare objects is group se aa sakte hain. At that time, we will select 0 object from this group or we may select r minus 1 objects from this group. Then, we will select 1 object from this group. If you select r minus 2 objects from this group, we will select 2 objects from this group and so on. If you select uh, 0 object from this group, then we have to select all r objects from this group because m is also greater than or equal to r. Okay. Now, here number of ways of selection of r objects equal to n c r number of selection of r minus 1 objects is equal to n c r minus 1. Here we have n c r minus 2 and so on and here we have n c 0. Here number of ways of selection is equal to m c 0. Uh, number of ways of selection here is equal to m c 1, here number of ways of selection is m c 2 and so on, here number of ways of selection is m c r. Okay. Now, we multiply uh, these two values, then we multiply these two values, we multiply these two values and so on and then we uh, add the multiplied values. Okay. The logic is we are selecting r objects from this group and 0 object from this group. So, number of ways will be m c 0 multiply by n c r or we put here plus sign for all r minus 1 objects from this group and 1 object from this group. So, we write here m c 1 multiply by n c r minus 1 or r minus 2 objects from this group and 2 objects from this group we write m c 2 multiply by n c r minus 2 and so on and for this case 0 object from this group and r objects from this group we write m c r multiply by n c 0. Okay. This is one way of calculating the number of ways and another way of calculating number of ways is that we uh, merge these two groups, I mean dono groups ko uh, mix kar dete hai, merge kar dete hai then there will be m plus n objects in one group okay and all this m plus n objects are distinct okay question ki condition jo uh, given hai uske hisab se sare objects kya ho jayenge distinct ho jayenge now we have to select r objects from these n plus n objects so number of ways of selection is m plus n c r so this is 
another way of counting okay we are equating this two number of ways and we have sum of the series as m plus n c r theek hai to permutation combination mein aisa bahut baar hota hai ki hum kuch situation create karke hum is type ke series ka sum nikal sakte hain 